The universe consists of a sheer unimaginable number of stars. Our Milky Way galaxy alone has approximately 200 billion, a quantity so large that any effort of truly grasping it is hopeless. If only a small fraction of these stars had planets orbiting at the right distance, with temperatures and atmospheric conditions that aren't hostile to life, our galaxy should be teeming with aliens. And yet there are none to be found. This is what is referred to as the Fermi Paradox. It is named after physicist Enrico Fermi, who during lunch break with his fellow scientists spontaneously blurted out, but where is everybody? Even though it was out of context, his colleagues immediately knew what he meant. What could possibly be the reason for the conflict between how many advanced civilizations ought to be in the universe and the lack of clear evidence? The search for extraterrestrial intelligence, in short SETI, has been going on for decades now, but no alien radio signals have ever been detected. Perhaps it's a mistake to assume that it is the natural progression of a civilization to develop radio technology as a means of communication. Maybe the aliens are using gravitational waves instead of electromagnetic waves. Another proposed explanation is the Great Filter Theory. It suggests that civilizations never advance beyond a certain point because of some catastrophic event that prevents them from reaching it. It may be that intelligent life is prone to overly exploit the resources that had made their existence possible in the first place, and that they self-destruct in resource conflicts motivated by greed. A third possibility is that our planet has already been discovered by aliens, but they are simply not interested in communicating with us. They are extraterrestrial intelligence whose definition of intelligence doesn't include us. In the same way that we aren't interested in communicating with ants because they can't comprehend our most ordinary thoughts, the intelligence gap between us and the aliens could be too large for proper communication. This would even be true if they were biologically similar and only slightly advanced. Just remember that we share almost 99% of our DNA with chimps, and yet they don't have the slightest clue about what we're up to and are completely at the mercy of our whims. There is one solution, however, that is quite a bit more sinister than the others. It is the theory laid out in the science fiction novel The Dark Forest. It compares the different alien populations throughout the galaxy to a hunter, stalking through a dark forest, doing his best to remain quiet for fear of being detected. The reasoning is that there is no way to know if other life forms can or will destroy you if given the chance. Lacking assurance, the safest option for any species is to annihilate other life forms before they have the chance to do the same. This means that the Fermi paradox itself may be the cause for why other species avoid being detected. Every life form is aware of this paradox and reasons on that basis that every contact with foreigners has ended in catastrophe. One look at what happened on Earth when two very different civilizations met gives credence to the dark forest theory. Often humans have behaved incredibly hostile upon discovering other peoples. If they didn't kill each other outright, they ruled over them with cruel disregard for their well-being.